All right, Teague, third place finish as a team. You guys are within, you know, you broke the 100 point barrier before the finals. You know, walk us through how you guys, first off, who you guys sitting next to you? Uh, this is my oldest daughter, Taylin, uh, one of my four kids. So she gets to ride home on the bus with daddy. So. She's got to be pumped. Yeah, she's excited. Okay, uh, walk us through the finals. First off, huge upset, 197 pounder, yeah. true freshman. Yeah. And he, was, uh, he brought the thunder, he, he created that scramble and he won that. Besides that, talk about the rest of the finals. Um, th th that finals match, you know, it's just, Alex is best when, when he creates a wrestling match. He's not the type to go out and be real strategic and make it into a chess match. He wants to get out, find some wrestling positions, and he's really good at figuring out. It, he, he's mature for a, a true freshman in that once he gets into a tough position, he figures out a way to score from there. So that was exciting. Uh, over our other's finals match, uh, Jay Ivanko, 133, you know, we, we, we ended up losing that match. Um, both guys wrestled hard. I just thought we didn't execute as well as we should have in the third period. We're up 1-0, and we take we took a bad shot and got spun on. It wasn't a bad shot. It was a horrible shot. Yeah, it was horrible. I mean, we went straight to the mat. So that, that's something we can work on. But Jay's had a rough start to the year. You know, he came into this tournament three and four, and just busting through and getting to the finals was a good step forward. So he's figuring himself out at 133. Yeah, because he was 25 last year. He qualified yeah. for the NCAAs. Yeah. And probably pulling too much weight. That's why you guys put him up. Yeah, he was he was cutting a lot of weight. Now he feels better at 33, and I think he's gonna he's gonna figure out how to win there pretty soon. All right. Uh, how about everyone else? What do you think? Um, you know, j real quickly, I'll go through our lineup. Our 25 pounder we had to change out yesterday. Our 25 pounder seven days ago was our third string 25 pounder. Um, you know, we had some issues with with our backup 25 pounder, our starter gets infected lymph noids, he's out. Yesterday, Trey is, is in the lineup, and he comes through and takes fifth. It was huge for us. First match to start the day, he loses 15-0, and beats that guy for fifth, one to zero. So, <laughs> huge improvement mm -hmm. in a matter of 10 hours. Uh, 33, Jay was in the finals. 41, Cameron Moran just got into that position this week after wrestle off, so he's just getting into the 141 spot, and, and he'll figure it out. Um, 49, James Fleming, uh, we went two and two today. James is way better than that. He's ranked 18th in the country uh, prior to this tournament. And uh, he's, he's a freshman that's got to figure out how he can score from his positions. 57, Hadley Harrison, not a good showing today. I don't think he wrestled to his positions. 65, we, we went 0-2. Um, 74, Stephen Cressley coming along. He's, he's another redshirted freshman. Um, 84, Clint Podish, last year a runner-up. Today just, just didn't look. Fourth? Yeah, fourth, just didn't look himself. Uh, heavyweight Quintos McCorkle, heavyweight, making huge leaps and bounds strides. I mean, I, I'm I'm really excited. Just the growth that Q has made from last year to this year. Last year he was one in 13. I don't know what his record is this year, but it's exponentially better. So. All right. Do you think you guys are making the strides? Obviously, you, know, you want to be in the top 10 in the country right now, but do you think you're making the strides that you want to? You know, realistically. Yeah, I I, I think when you when you take a step back and you realize. Um, some of the obstacles that we got to overcome just to get where we're at right now. We're, we're, we're doing good things. Um, we, we still need to, we still make some, as a team, we make some uh, mistakes while we're out there wrestling that are correctable. And to me, that's exciting. We got to put on a lot of horsepower. Um, we got pushed around a lot today. But when you got as many freshmen and sophomore in our lineup as we do, it's, that's going to happen. So we hit the weights. I think good things will come. You got anything else for me, too? No, man. I, I'm. I'm excited that we're into the start of the year and, and our freshman class is really stepping up to the plate and showing they can do it. So um, good things will come. We just got to get back to work and, and get better. All right, T, get on that bus and enjoy that white knuckle riding. <laughs> yeah, will do, buddy. <laughs> you Thanks, too. T. Have a safe trip home.